We tend to dislike mysteries. Hello guys, welcome back to this YouTube channel. In this video, we will present to you 10 horror films that tell stories about terrible cults. What are these films? Check out the following. Number 10, Mandy. Mandy is a horror thriller film released in 2018, directed by Panos Cosmatos and starring Nicolas Cage and Andrea Riseborough. This cult film tells the story of Red Miller's revenge attempt. Previously, Red Miller, Nicolas Cage, and Mandy Bloom, Andrea Riseborough, lived a peaceful and quiet life. However, their fragile peace is shattered when a group of cults obsessed with violence and the supernatural, led by a cruel leader named Jeremiah Sand, Linus Roach, suddenly appears in their area. Jeremiah is attracted to Mandy and orders his followers to kidnap her. Mandy is then tortured and tortured in front of Red by Jeremiah's followers. After Mandy rejects Jeremiah, he is snuffed out before Red's eyes, leaving Red in desolation and despair. With a heart full of revenge and eyes full of anger, Red launches a mission of revenge to avenge Mandy's tragic death. This film is considered a comeback from Nicolas Cage, after previously he more often starred in B-class films. Let us be so very special together. Go. Yeah, and then I got the opportunity and I Number decided, 9, I Midsommar. Going. I just wish you would have told me, that's all. Midsommar tells the story of a group of friends who travel to a remote village in Sweden to attend the Midsummer Festival. Donnie, a young woman who has recently experienced a family tragedy, joins her boyfriend, Christian and his friends to visit this remote community. Arriving at the village, the group was greeted with beautiful views and unique traditions. But as time goes by, they begin to realize that this festival has a terrible dark side. The strange rituals and violence that occur among the villagers make them feel threatened and unsafe. Donnie and her friends soon realize that they are trapped in a terrible game and must fight to survive amidst unfathomable horrors. Absolutely not. What's happening? Midsommar is directed by Ari Aster and stars Florence Pugh, Jack Rayner, William Jackson Harper, Wilhelm Blomgren, and Will Polder. This film, which was released in 2019, received very positive reviews, and offers an unusual horror story, which is its main selling point. I was most excited for you to come. Number 8, The Cabin in the Woods. The Cabin in the Woods follows a group of five who decide to spend their weekend at a remote cabin in the woods. They set out for a quiet getaway, but soon discover that something far more terrifying is waiting for them there. As they begin to explore the cottage, they discover a basement filled with strange items. We're come to the killing floor. Get this party started! Without realizing it, they have become the subjects of horrific experiments orchestrated by a group of evil scientists, cults. The scientists control everything that happens around the lodge and bet on the fate and death of the victims. The victims fight to survive and uncover the truth behind the experiments before it is too late. They must face various terrible dangers and obstacles, including scary horror creatures and deadly traps. This cult film was released in 2012 and was directed by Drew Goddard. Meanwhile the script was written by Joss Whedon and Drew Goddard, with the film starring Kristen Connolly, Chris Hemsworth, Anna Hutchison, Fran Kranz, Jesse Williams, Richard Jenkins, and Bradley Whitford. I see the faces Number 7, Red State. Red this is probably the most underrated cult film on this list. This cult film stars Michael Parks, John Goodman, Melissa Leo, and Michael Angarano and was released in 2011. Red State tells the story of three teenage boys who are drawn to answer an online ad inviting them to join a woman in a rural area. Bet you boys want to get up to the devil's business, don't you? However, they soon realize that they have fallen into the trap of an extremist cult led by a charismatic leader, Aben Cooper. When the local police found out about the sect's existence and threatened to attack, the situation became even more tense. A bloody battle is inevitable when the cult and the police face each other, with the three teenagers caught in the middle of the conflict. Repeat. Red State combines elements of a horror thriller with a sharp social critique of religious fanaticism and extremist violence. The film presents a dark and tense atmosphere throughout the story, with the audience being taken on a journey filled with suspense and surprises. Fornication, adultery, abortion, 
in which each waking day we rise Number 6, Apostle This island Apostle follows the story of a man named Thomas Richardson who travels to a remote island in Wales in the early 20th century. Thomas comes to the island to rescue his little sister, who has been kidnapped by a mysterious and cruel cult. The sect is led by a charismatic leader named Prophet Malcolm. Bring her home. Name. When Thomas infiltrates the community in disguise, he soon discovers that there are many dark secrets associated with the cult, including sadistic practices and the existence of terrifying supernatural entities. As time passes, Thomas becomes increasingly trapped in this dangerous and mysterious world, where he must fight not only to save his sister, but also to survive against forces far greater and evil than he could have ever imagined. Apostle is produced by XYZ Films and Severn Screen. The film was released in 2018 and was directed by Gareth Evans, who previously had success with the film The Raid. Apostle stars several names such as Dan Stevens, Lucy Boynton, Mark Lewis Jones, and Michael Sheen. Number 5, Ready or Not. Good luck. Ready or Not is directed by Matt Bedinelli Alpin and Tyler Gillette. This cult film stars Samara Weaving, Adam Brody, Mark O'Brien, and Henry Cherney. Where the film was released in 2019. Ready or Not was produced by Fox Searchlight Pictures and Radio Silence Productions, and tells the story of a young bride named Grace who has just married a wealthy husband from the Ladomas family. A family that owns a gaming and entertainment business. Family. A game. After the wedding, Grace is invited to participate in a strange family tradition, playing a game determined by a box of playing cards. However, Grace quickly realizes that the game has very dangerous consequences. When the cards he pulls reveal that the game chosen is hide and seek, he learns that the family members have a sinister plan to hunt him down as part of a family ritual. What the hell is this? How old is this thing? In an increasingly intense and harrowing game, Grace fights to survive and uncover the dark secrets of the Ladomas family. With the help of her husband, Alex, played by Mark O'Brien, and attractive brother-in-law, Daniel, played by Adam Brody, Grace attempts to escape the family and end the curse that has bound them for centuries. Did you think that? I wanted to get married. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Rob, what Number four, nice the ritual. The best of us. The ritual follows four men from England who traveled to a forest in Norway as a tribute to their friend who died in a tragic shop robbery. During the journey, one of them is injured, forcing them to find a shortcut through the forest. As they explore the dense forest, they find an old, empty cottage, where they decide to spend the night. However, this decision leads them to an unexpected terror when they realize that they are not alone in the forest. They begin to be chased by a mysterious force that stalks them in the forest, and they must fight to survive. At the same time, they must also uncover the dark truth behind the creature's existence and the ancient secrets hidden in the forest. This cult film was released in 2017, and was adapted from Adam Neville's novel of the same title. Nothing has done that to you. You've done it to yourself. Why do you have to deny everything? What the fuck is that? Fuck no, we don't know where we are! Number 3, Rosemary's Baby. Rosemary's Baby tells the story of a young couple, Rosemary and Guy Woodhouse, who move into their new apartment in New York City. They then become friends with eccentric neighbors, Minnie and Roman Castavet. One night, Rosemary experiences a terrible nightmare, which leads to a series of strange and unexpected events. You know how actors are, they're all a bit self-centered. After receiving the happy news that she is pregnant, Rosemary begins to feel strange changes in her body and suspects that her neighbors, especially Minnie, are involved in a sinister conspiracy regarding her baby. Rosemary's suspicions increase when she realizes that her pregnancy is abnormal and gets closer to giving birth. What have you done to him, you maniac? Number 2, The Wicker Man. The Wicker Man was released on December 1, 1973. Directed by Robin Hardy, this approximately 88-minute film tells the story of Sergeant Neil Howie, played by Edward Woodward. A devout policeman, traveling to a remote island called Summer Isle in Scotland to investigate the disappearance of a young girl named Rowan Morrison. You are despicable little liars. When he arrived on the island, 
he discovered that the local population was involved in pagan beliefs and strange practices. How he meets the head of the cult, Lord Summerisle, played by Christopher Lee, who explains that they believe that worship of their ancient gods is the key to their fertility and survival. Howie becomes increasingly convinced that the missing girl will be the victim in a planned religious ritual. There is Rowan Morrison. Oh my god! Number 1. Hereditary <sighs> Come on, Peter. Hereditary tells the story of the Graham family who begin experiencing strange events after the death of their grandmother, Ellen. Annie Graham, played by Tony Collette, mother of two teenage sons, Peter, played by Alex Wolfe, and Charlie, played by Millie Shapiro feels that something is wrong with her family. She had private rituals, private friends. This family must face the dark forces that haunt them, which are tied to a dark family history and hidden secrets. The horrific events escalated and gradually affected the Graham family's mental health. As they become caught up in the worsening chaos, Annie begins to dig deeper into her family's legacy and stop what is happening. Directed by Ari Aster, Hereditary was released on June 8, 2018. Some of the main actors involved in this film include Tony Collette, Alex Wolfe, Millie Shapiro, and Gabriel Byrne. Meanwhile, the duration of this film is around 127 minutes. Those are some horror films that deal with the theme of evil cults. These films show terrifying scenes, and of course are very suitable for those of you who are waiting for quality horror films. Among these films, which is your favorite? That's enough for this video, don't forget to press the subscribe button, like and comment on this video so that we are more enthusiastic about making other top 10 videos. And of course, share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.